Hello all, this is basically a video to show an easy way to fill your fuel tanks without getting a mess on the side of the tank. As you know, a clean truck sells a clean business. So it's always best, my brother taught me that, it's always best to keep your vehicle clean, especially when on the road and delivering to customers. So basically I have my fuel tank, which is, as you can see, very clean for winter time. Basically what you're going to do is, I keep these in here, an extra set of gloves, because you want to keep an extra pair of gloves, one for when you make dock deliveries, the other for when you actually fuel, because you want to keep your gloves separate. You go to Walmart and you buy yourself a set of hand towels. You get like 12 in a package, they're very cheap, only cost a couple extra bucks. Next you want to do is take that towel, you want to open the towel completely up. Okay. Next, fuel cap. An old fuel cap. It's actually, it's a locking cap, which I have two of them in the truck in case I go in a really bad section of town, leave the truck overnight, I can lock my fuel up. So I take these and I place it into the center at the top, leaving a little bit of overlay at the top up here. Basically what I'll do then is I'll circle it with a black magic marker. I'll then use a pair of very sharp scissors to then cut the fabric evenly around the edges. You want to use a towel though too because a rag will just fray and it'll fall apart. An old t-shirt, they don't work as good. They don't last near as long, but they do work. Basically then, when you come into the fuel station, which I'll go ahead and set this down for a second and I'll put my gloves on show you basically what this is. Basically, what you're going to do is take your towel and you're going to lay it over the fuel cap, like so. As you can see, it fits evenly at the top ends and it filters at the bottom. If it's raining out, it sticks to the tank. So, it's not so bad even when it's raining. You can wipe it off though when it's raining. Next, you're going to unscrew your cap. Which this truck is full, so we got to be careful here. And lay your cap on top. This will keep the towel from blowing off the top of the truck. Fill your truck. Any overspill will spill from the inside of the actual rim here and overspill onto the mat. I only say overspill, and I know you're supposed to keep your tank a little low, and that's what you're. That's what you learn, and that's what I have here. But when you're filling the tank, it has a way of bubbling and shooting and you get these sputter marks down the side of the tank. This keeps the tank clean. Basically then what I do is I take the cap then and I put the cap back over the top. Before I screw the cap down, I remove the mat. Which is difficult when you only have one hand. And then I screw the cap back on. Then I take my actual mat, fold it back up, and I place it back underneath of the seat again, along with my gloves, which stay just with this mat. This is an easy alternative. Obviously, it doesn't work for those that have skirts. I've had skirts before on the sides of the truck where it made it almost impossible to do that. I say your best standing then is to take a actual bath towel like that and then stuff it into the bottom edge of it where the skirt meets at the bottom of the tank and then if you get it in the overspill it doesn't actually run down the tank. Even though you don't physically see the tank it still makes the truck neat. When you go for service and that guys don't put their hands up underneath there and say this guy keeps his truck filthy. Thought it would be a great idea. Thanks for watching. If you have any other ideas post a comment. Thank you.